Giants. They've also got Leandro Damian, all just gone out of shape after that support touch from Hasegawa. Below, and running just ahead of him is Ninkovic. Fonda always not far away from not going anywhere. Nara, a dangerous area, and Damian it was the striker had to climb and get some sort of connection with it. On of Grant, that's actually Noborizato. And here is Hasegawa. Tobin almost managing to squeeze the ball through. Brosk. I think uh, Hasegawa, Leandro Damiao, Yukobayashi in the box waiting for a good delivery. It goes long just behind Kobayashi. And plays a very clever move and a wonderful touch. Ball inside to Damiao. Just slightly. And quite nicely. Can't direct his shot on target. I keep surging down that left hand side. Sydney FC playing catch up. Damiao. Team resulted in red card. He bounced back to score two goals that year in the competition. Steve Balls found its way through to Lafondra. There's that handball. Kobayashi waiting in the box for Hasegawa to pull out his bag of tricks. He did over two. Receiving number Rosato. It's just benching him. It's just that touch where it was marginally too long. Brost. Nakamura has now gone 342 minutes without conceding a goal. Just piercing the pass all the way out. And offside though. There's no Brizato. Yeah. This time found by Kobayashi. Uses his body well. And that is a splendid save by Redman. There he is. Hajime Moriyasu. Japanese team coach. Snapshot. Really does test Redmayne in goals, sleep just over that halfway line, but he just gets his feet, gets his body set and has a trying to match the run. Kobayashi has done superbly well to keep it alive, and that was almost an open goal, but he couldn't make picked up the pace a little bit, picked up a gear. They have to be wary of Sydney who are so bow delivery right now. Here it comes. Goalkeeper's lost it. I don't think there was a fun. A clever pass inside to Hasegawa. Tanaka. Strong defensive line for Sydney FC, but Kawasaki are able to get him. And nobody's out of. Yanaga, how good was that ball? Morita, he had Tam Kamura. Another superb delivery just behind Damiao. He's got to fashion up the chance all by himself. Morita, hardly see a Kawasaki player hit it long. Yeah, that's the reason why they bought uh, Damiao into the side. Red name could have held it, but he took no chances with Kobayashi just behind him. Defensive midfield shell not to join in with the attacks. Ninkovic couldn't score superbly for Zulo. Still Zulo. He swung in, but straight at the head of Taniguchi. Ninkovic handball. Kawasaki winner. Nobody Zato. Did we talk about him? being explosive coming forward wide and Yanaga going through the middle so I said they both have been interchangeable in matches whenever they play Brosk only scrap then to give it away again good work by his in Tigerish is Tanaka there might be a goal scoring opportunity now for Sydney yeah the Yashi he's found some room didn't find a teammate inside Hasegawa late in arriving. Ending still. Put the ball in behind so accurately with enough. Broski, perhaps unlucky, cross the defense. Create the space and open the space up for his fellow striker. That was Dami out. Defense. Finally, space opening up. Oh. It's one on one defensive situations. There really are some excellent battles all over pressure. Brosk finding space behind the defense momentarily, but Taniguchi is always there. So much. Grant. From Wilkinson. Hasegawa. Slightly behind Noborizato. Made a run. It's very good work by the Kawasaki midfield. Awesome defending from Kawasaki. Good passion play. Reed. 
That is the half-time whistle in a match that has failed to spark. The way this game has evolved, I do feel that both teams would expect a little bit better of Nakamura. Just picking pocket once again. Yanaga just slightly offside. Almost dipping the ball into space for Grant, who had made that run and stayed in its infancy. Exceptional player. Oh, it's a cross that's just to loot Hasegawa. Tanaka, space opening up for Nakamura. That is a heavy touch by Yanaga. Somehow got away with it. Oh, that's pretty crude on Nobu A lot more incisive from the Kawasaki side. Kobayashi's taking a tumble. He didn't like that decision. Lefondre. Good delivery needed. It's way too flat. Gawa was behind him. He says, go do your magic now and create something for me. He stays inside the box. Nakamura. To this takes a break, man. I think if you ask him that question now, he would still be looking at demonstrate this evening defensively. What a what? Oh, it's an ambitious effort. I think it took a touch off Redmayne. Did just slightly behind Nara. Oh, brilliant striker. What a save that one was. That was magnificent to the relief. The Sydney players. Players inside the box and try to hold that one up in the win. To match the run of Kobayashi, Yanaga, Asegawa. Nakamura wanted the first time pass and three prone through the years. Kobayashi. It certainly is. playing as a fault tonight, Hasegawa, space just behind it, Tanaka, it certainly is a dangerous position, it's minimal, Yashi and Chinen, Yanaga, chance for the shots while he just ran into traffic, just ran right, box waiting for a good delivery, after a little mistake, a toe poker, bigger, is the quality that he possesses. The goalkeeper did not come. Our who's been at the thorn of the Sydney FC side, Yanaga, clips it up, couldn't find the player at the far post. Yuto Suzuki glides past one, not the other. Corner Kawasaki. It's of the ball. It's headed away though. Here is Nakamura finding the room for the cross too close. He did say last season that's uh, with Nobris to Hasegawa, Yanaga, this is a superb build-up, they just couldn't find it on his job. Referees called it back because there was no advantage for the Fondra. Suzuki, that's pretty ambitious to the Kobayashi, the sandwich between two giants. Well worked by Tanaka, oh he's done it brilliantly, saved by the goalkeeper again and the re- Very clever turn, Hasegawa. Looking for Kobayashi, who's kept it alive. Chin. Dinks it into space for Hasegawa. Took too long to actually end defending it. Tanaka has done. He's got all the trickery in the world. Hasegawa. Around Ivanovic easily. Grant, good covering from his way here to Kawasaki Pantale. His career hasn't taken off yet. Chinen! Oh. Is that in play? Let's go wide and see what it does. Suzuki's ball inside, bouncing all over, and it's a goal from the substitute. Manabu Saito breaks the heart of Sydney FC and finally breaks the shield that's been put in front of them for 83 minutes. It's a mad scramble. But it goes in, and Saito scores just his second goal for Kawasaki Frontale. And what an important goal this might turn out to be in their Champions League campaign this year. Saito, his own player got in the way. 
we struck it brilliantly too. Well, it's kept alive. Back in football. So dangerous when they pour forward. That's going to be a free kick. It's Nakamura. Kobayashi to run into the box and get this pass from Chinan. Just slightly behind. See. Heading into the final few minutes. Crosses put in by Zulo. That's a good ball by Caceres. Grant took it past one, but not the other. Tani Guj stopped. And that tracks the saving. Because he's not any ordinary defender. Chinan happy to take it. Even his headed passes are so accurate and so effective. Yet again. There, that is the only.